them. I'm Avery. And I'm Todd. Assuming as how it's getting nicer outside more frequently, we figured it'd be helpful to talk about the importance of protecting ourselves against the sun. On top of that, Avery, today's a very, very important national holiday. Oh, not that I've not that I've heard of. More about sun production after news and announcements. In news this morning, as gas prices have hit a record high, Biden struggles to reassure America. Biden's claim at a press conference in Japan is that he will try to keep the gas prices from getting worse, and the U.S. and the world are going through an incredible transition to green energy as the prices of gas climb every day. In other news, in an apartment complex on the east side of Syracuse, tenants had no water for five days. In apartment buildings 112, 114, and 116 last had water on Thursday last week. Temperatures reached the 90s on Saturday and heat advisory was issued. The building was declared unfit. The owner, Karim Corgi, put a handwritten note on the door stating that the water was off and a plumber would be coming. The plumber who arrived on Friday could not fix the problem. Days passed and on Monday they did some digging. The cause of the backup in the sewer was that kids threw rocks down it. The water was fixed by Monday afternoon. Netflix inducts the first four comedians into upstate New York's Hall of Fame. George Carlin, Richard Pryor, Joan Rivers, and Robin Williams were honored during a Netflix joke festival. The inductees were voted by a board of agents, club owners, managers, and other members of the comedy community. The event honored recently departed stars such as Norm MacDonald and Bob Saget. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The morning weigh room will be closed on Wednesday, May 25th. Please see Coach Eschbacher if you have any questions. Please help Noah's Care Bags achieve its goal to help parents and guardians who are staying with their child in a children's hospital to take care of themselves and to keep a family together. We provide toiletries to meet their physical needs and candy bar to remain to remind them to eat and positive quote and message for emotional support. Drop off at our collection bin in the high school lobby through May 26th or donate online at noahcarebags.com. There will be a take a look at teaching club meeting after school Wednesday in room C4. We'll be learning about careers in school counseling and elementary education for our guest speakers. All are welcome. See Ms. Karochi with questions. So Todd, as far as our... Is protecting our skin, the most important thing to look out for is the UV index. The UV index provides a daily forecast of the expected intensity of the ultraviolet radiation from the sun. Overexposure to the sun's ultraviolet radiation can cause immediate damage such as sunburn and long-term problems such as skin cancer or cataracts. Low UV index consists of anything lower than 2, while a high index is between 6 and 7. A very high to extreme index is anywhere from 7 to 11. There are many ways to protect ourselves from getting burnt in the sun, which we'll discuss after weather. Now let's find out if we need some sunscreen for the rest of the week over at Weather. Today we will have a high of 72 and a low of 52, and tomorrow we will have a high of 76 and a low of 58, and I'm Abby with your weather. Todd, there are many ways to protect ourselves from the sun, as you may already know. But you should always wear sunscreen and apply it to your skin every day, no matter if you tan well or not. True. Avoid the sun in the middle of the day from about 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. The UV rays which cause sunburns are strongest during those hours. Wear protective clothing and also wear sunglasses that filter UV light to protect your eyes. Also, find the right sunscreen for you. For the people that might have sensitive skin, it might be important to find a brand that doesn't irritate your skin. With more than 20 different brands of sunscreen, there should be no problem finding one that works for you.
Boston Celtics tied the series at two games apiece after winning game four, 102 to 82 against Miami Heat. And I'm Aiden with sports. From Todd and I. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are what? you serious, Avery? You didn't even address the national holiday. I mean, come on. Do you really know what today is? No, I don't. Okay, all right. It's National Brothers Day. Not everything is about you, Todd. Okay, all right. From Avery and I and everyone here at The Morning Show, we hope you have a happy National Brothers Day. And don't forget your sunscreen.